Hey guys, um, so by the title of this video you probably know what I'm about to say. Um, I am at the doctor's right now, well actually I'm in my car, but I am um, waiting to go to a doctor's appointment because I found a lump and I know it's probably crazy that I would find something like that or I mean I don't know what it could be. I'm going to get it checked out. I'm only 26 years old and that's what a lot of my friends and family keep saying like you're only 26 it's probably nothing um, but for my ease of mind I'm gonna get it checked out um, my appointment isn't for another 15 minutes so I decided just to kind of chat with you guys in the car really quick to kind of fill you guys in as to what's going on um, so yeah I'm waiting in my car um, for my doctor's appointment I'm kind of nervous and like I completely forgot that my doctor was connected to the hospital where I gave birth to Macy at and that already gives me anxiety because Macy's birth was such like a traumatic experience and I haven't been back here since. I didn't think I was going to get emotional. So, I think it was just a hard day. It could be nothing. It could be, I don't know, like it could be, I don't know. Um, it sucks being a girl. But either way, just coming on to tell you guys what's going on um I don't know like if they're gonna do any tests or if I'll know anything if I will know anything today um I really don't know I've never really had to deal with anything like this but I think like what's making it worse is that like I'm at the hospital that I that was probably like the most traumatic experience of my life I don't know how I forgot that. I don't know how I forgot that my doctor was um, attached to here. So, yeah. I am making this video because I want to be like, 100% real and open with you guys I know you guys only see like a very small portion of our day of our life um, but all of that is real like we don't do anything for the camera it's gross I had a napkin in my car we don't do anything special for the camera like that's our life and since this is a part of my life right now and something that I'm going through I figured I needed to share with you guys because I just felt like it'd be like really hiding something that's important to me that could potentially even like help any of you guys. I mean, I'm 26 years old and I know a lot of my followers are my friends. Like I know you guys, the people who follow me and, and y'all are all around my age and it, it's like something that you don't think about because of how young we feel like we are but at the same time like it could really happen to anybody and I'm not saying like it's happening to me I'm just saying that I'm, I'm just saying like we should all be aware as to what's happening in our bodies and the funny thing is like I've been trying to be super healthy lately I've completely like changed my diet I started working out and doing all this stuff to really like clean my body from the inside out and then this happens so I'm like it's like I can't catch a break I don't know I almost just want to go in now I still have like 10 minutes but before like that's what I'd be like 15 minutes early to my appointment so I'd be like 25 minutes early but I'm just like so eager and I just like hate being here. I honestly didn't think it was going to make me this emotional. 
but it really is like it's so weird I wish I like knew and like vlogged you like through the whole process with Macy because those of you who guys like those of you because I know I have some new subscribers on here and those of you guys who don't know me I had a um a really premature baby and she stayed in the hospital for um two months and this was like her hospital like her home for those two months and it was just hard so I'm gonna get myself together and then I'm gonna go inside I'm not really sure how much I'm gonna be able to vlog that but I will update you guys the moment that I get back hey guys good morning so it is now the following day um, yesterday we I ended up staying at that um, doctor's office forever can you see me I ended up staying at the doctor's office forever um, and I did the I mean I stayed at the doctor's office for like three hours so I was just ready to come home after that I picked up the girls and then I also picked up some food for us to eat and then just waited for Josh to get home but I did want to update you guys um, as to what my doctor said and what I still have to do so um, my doctor did do a pretty thorough exam and she thinks that it might be like a um, like my muscle inflamed because I I like pulled something in that muscle um, or like she thinks I have like a tiny tear in my muscle which caused it to be it, it's like technically like it's like my pectoral muscle that's inflamed um, so she thinks that's what it is but she did order me to get an ultrasound done um, on both sides um, and so I'll be doing that on Monday so yesterday was Friday and today it's Saturday um, so I'll be doing that on Monday morning and then hopefully I think they said that the radiologist reads it right then and there and then they will tell me what to do or what needs to be done afterwards so I am like eager to get that done um, right now we are all gonna go work out Hi. we haven't seen them in a while yeah, yeah I don't think you guys have seen Josh in a while I have hair again a lot of hair um, so we're gonna go work out me and Josh go do a um, a gym in the area and then we're taking the girls because they do have like child care available for them so we're gonna go do that it's 9 a.m. on sa on Saturday morning um, I'm gonna try to take you guys along I'm not sure oh I gotta answer this. Daddy. hey so um, sorry I got a phone call um, yeah so we're gonna go do that I'm gonna see I don't know how much I can really film just because I just started going and it's kind of weird sometimes like just whipping out my camera um, but yeah so that's what we're gonna do right now and then I don't know what we're gonna do afterwards I really don't know what we're gonna do for the day I just knew that we wanted to work out today so I'll take you guys along <laughs> Okay, so we just got done with our workout. What did you think, babe? I thought it was good. I thought it was nice and like <laughs> good for everybody. Yeah, it was Josh's first time. Um, Kinsey, I think the door is open. Um, it was Josh's first time coming here, so he was excited to try it out. It's a lot of cardio. It's pretty intense. It's very intense. Um, this place that I go to for the workout. It just opened up about two weeks ago, so we've been going, or I've been going um, this past week, and then I ended up going, like I ended up submitting a, a contract to start going there um, every week. So I'm excited to try that out. Kinsey, did you have fun at the kids camp? No. Hey guys, so sorry. <laughs> I um. I was just driving right now and I was listening to this podcast or whatever it was on the, the, the radio and it was hilarious. I couldn't stop laughing. Anyways, happy Monday. It is probably a second away for you guys, but it is Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Three days from when I last um, pulled out the camera. So last time you saw me, I was, it was Friday and I was um, going to get my 
get myself checked through my doctor um, she now then referred me to a radiologist or a specialist I don't know what they are um, that I have to get an ultrasound done so I am here doing that today I tried to get it done on Friday but I went to two different places and one of the places the guy the radiologist left early and they have to be there um, in order for me to be able to get my ultrasound down, done and then the other one was I think they were already closed or something they were about they couldn't fit me in um, so now I'm getting it done I wanted to film what I did this weekend but we really didn't do much we just really stayed home and then watched um, football on Sunday it was not really like fun or interesting so that's why I didn't vlog it um, so that's why I'm like picking up right now um, on Monday so I'm gonna take you guys along I'm gonna hopefully I don't know what exactly I'll be able to film in there but I'll definitely be able to check in with you guys after the appointment I am done that was super nerve-wracking and at the end she needed to contact somebody to see if she needed to do like further pictures or a further exam I'm not sure um, but it was kind of spooky like it was it was like nerve-wracking because I didn't know like she wasn't able to tell me if she saw anything so now I'm gonna have to wait 24 to 48 hours to even get those results so by the time you guys see this I probably would get the results already but please say your prayers if you guys pray please include me in those prayers because I'm super nervous I really hope everything is okay um, I don't know like I don't know I don't know I've never done anything or been through anything like this so please keep me in your prayers um, I guess I will end the vlog now it probably wasn't super long or super exciting but I um, I did want sorry there's somebody right there looking at me um, but I did want to keep you guys updated and I did want to tell you guys um, what's going on in my life right now so yeah thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe please like this video um, leave comments in down below if you guys have ever experienced anything like this um, I don't know hey guys don't mind my appearance I just came back from the gym but I wanted to fill you guys in because I got my um, ultrasound done yesterday Hold on. I got my ultrasound done yesterday and um, I got my results back today so so it wasn't um, that long at all and let me see oh I don't have my paper it's inside my car but it basically said that um, there was like concern on both sides and it says that it was dense breast tissue so I'm waiting for my doctor to call me back but I think that's pretty normal I think um, I googled it you know Google knows everything and it says like people who are smaller which I have like a smaller frame um, it's super common in like girls who are smaller and stuff so I think I'll be okay I just wanted to fill you guys in I didn't want to leave you guys hanging because I was about to like end the vlog and um, edit it and stuff and I didn't want to do it without telling you guys that I just got that paper um, so yeah I guess I'm gonna keep you guys posted throughout like I guess forever until anything changes or whatever but um, I did want to let you guys know so I think I'm gonna leave it at that that will be the end of the vlog I hope you guys have a good day please like subscribe um, and we'll see you guys next time